Bio Ecotalk Research Center. Bio Ecotalk Research Center established in 2013. This idea began from international collaboration among member Bio Ecotalk, Université de Harvard, and Toxamsar French. Initial meeting for research collaboration among Universitas Brawijaya, Université du Havre, and Toxamsar in November 2010 at Université du Havre. Sampling activity did in Brantas Delta in for ecotoxicology research in December 2011. This research collaboration continues until 2012 by International Seminar Agenda on Molecular Ecotoxicology at Universitas Brawijaya in January 2012. Until now, BioEcotoc developed the professional linkage to other universities in Europe. Member of BioEcotoc consists of six lecturers researchers from different faculty in Universitas Brawijaya and different scientific background. become an excellent research center internationally in marine biopharmacognosy and ecotoxicology. Bioecotox aims to provide research results in marine bioresources, pharmacognosy, and ecotoxicology to generate output in the form of patents, products, services, books, and publications. Bioecotox is a research center which conducts research in two main fields area. First is bioresources and biopharmacognosy of marine species. The second is ecotoxicology. We provide ecotoxicological service, for example, monitoring of aquatic biodiversity and environmental health, and planning evolution of environmental management. For marine bioresources product, we provide also cell line, for example, MCS7 for cancer cell line, microalgae production for health, food and cosmetics, extract from marine products for various uses and applications. In marine bioresources and biopharmacognosy, result of our research about anti-cancer from marine species and bioactive compound from macroalgae. Right now, one of laboratory experiment is microalgae cultured. We produce marine microalgae in lab scale and produce it until intermediate scale, then finally to large or mass scale. The optimum growth of microalgae is 5 days, so each 5 days we do a refresh or reculture the microalgae. Beside the refresh activity, we try also to isolate the specific microalgae from water environment and identification them by using inverted microscope. One of the benthic diatom may be potential has antioxidant, antibacterial or antimicrobial activities that can against pathogen. These data are our research result in ecotoxicology. The results show the antiproliferatic effect of EDC.
Some laboratorial experiment is also using GLSM to see the cell organism. This is an example for a bioactive compound uh, from brown microalgae, sargassum, as anti-cancer. Uh, we use uh, MCF7 cell line, which is stained by a P53 gen. To get the data and the specific microalgae, we collect water sample for the sea in different sites in Java Sea and Bali Strait. The aim of sampling is to isolate some microalgae specific and to test their compound. We work in several organisms before like corals to test their secondary metabolite to anti-inflammation medicine. Bioecotoc members are active in doing some researchers. We are already having 14 patent registration number. During the last four years, my Ecotot result publication journal of more than 60 articles from international and national journals. Until now, we have also some uh, collaboration for more than 10 collaborations with universities in Indonesia and with foreign universities. We participate also in uh, some international associations like Primo, SETA, and joint working group with friends, which is held every year in different locations and countries. Besides the research publication, we promote and develop our external link with other institutions, both national and international, by doing some collaboration. The activity are like below, Research internship at Université du Maine in October 2016. Keynote person and collaboration initiation with Jeju University, South Korea in December 2016. And consortium collaboration workshop at Universitas Brawijaya in November 2016. We are also active in seminar participation like attend international conference held in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, November 2016. International conference SITAK held in Singapore on September 2016. Join working group French Indonesia held in La Rochelle, French, April 2016. ICOEE conference held by LSIH at Universitas Brawijaya in October 2015. In 2017, the Ecotech staff to participate in Ghana project that is funded by the European Union. Beside me, the member of the Ghana is Lastri Arsat that will conduct research for the Ghana Sasea. And then, this Ghana project consists of 22 academic and an academic institutions partner from 12 countries who are distributed in five continents in the world. We welcome other institutes or enterprises for collaboration in marine by resources, biopharmacognosy, and ecotoxicological activities. For further information, please visit our website 